out with the old and in with the new. Starting next week, there will be some changes coming to the way you can recycle and put out your trash within the city of Pittsburgh. Whether it's the box from your favorite Christmas gift or bottles left over from a holiday party, chances are your garbage cans may look a little full. And we have to do something because we got so much garbage. But if you live within city limits, changes may be coming to what you can put out and when you can do so. I try to be conscious and I try to do my part. Um, a lot of times I will just take my stuff down to the uh, recycling station on 31st Street in the Strip. Today, the city of Pittsburgh announcing changes to its recycling and trash collection for the new year, as the city says they look to be more eco-friendly. We want to, you know, reduce the level of litter, but also reduce those negative environmental impacts there. The first major change, no more blue plastic bags previously given out by the city for recycling bins. When we have the bags, it, it clogs all the sorting mis uh, machinery and it's an issue um, with us in that end. So very minor changes, but for a very good uh, return. Instead, you'll have to dump your recyclables loosely in the bin at the curb. Now, when it comes to cardboard, that will only be picked up on designated days moving forward. Any cardboard that is put out in the off weeks will be left now. In the past, we've taken it to try to clean up the streets, but we want that material to go to recycling. Mount Washington resident Charlotte Flam is all for recycling, but worries that her elderly neighbors will have a hard time adjusting to the changes. You're seniors. What are you going to do? It's hard to break something down and, you know, remember to put it here, put it there. The city says these changes aren't that bad and go hand in hand with the new bag ban policy enacted earlier this year. And those that don't follow the rules will receive a warning and may face potential fines. We have more information about those fines available for you at WTAE.com. Reporting from Mount Washington, I'm Lily Coleman for Pittsburgh's Action News 4.